Hey there crew and welcome to a special announcement on some fall field trips I have coming up that I'd like you to be a part of if you can make it work for you. Uh, these are field trips just for you YouTube viewers, not affiliated with the college that I work for at all. And I've finally been able to look at my fall schedule, my teaching load here at the college, and balance some things a bit and be able to put together some new field trip offerings for you. So I want to show you these field trips that will be offered this fall and tell you a little bit about them, how to sign up and such if you or anyone you know is interested. So I branched out a bit from just having field trips in southern Idaho and put together a set of field trips in northern Utah, sort of in the Salt Lake City, Ogden area. So there'll be three of those at the end of September, the 27th, 28th, and 29th. One trip will be to Little Cottonwood Canyon near Salt Lake City. Uh, the other one will be at Antelope Island State Park, which is an island in the Great Salt Lake. And then the third trip is a bit of a transect from Ogden Canyon over to Echo Canyon, kind of working our way through uh, the severe fold and thrust belt, which is a really cool area of geology. So uh, those are the three trips there. Um, and there's more information on the website here I'll show you in a second. And then I have a section of trips that will be offered October 11th, 12th, and 13th. And these are essentially a repeat of the trips I did this past June here in Southern Idaho. So one day out at Craters of the Moon National Monument, looking at the volcanic landscapes, a day at City of Rocks National Reserve, looking at some of the granitic landforms and some of the interesting rocks there. And then for lack of a better title, just some of the diverse volcanoes of the Snake River Plain north of Twin Falls from here. Um, up towards the town of Haley in that area. So there's a set of field trips there, similar to the June trips. And then the other set of trips that I'm repeating for folks that haven't been are two trips centered around Twin Falls, November 8th and 9th, one in the Snake River Canyon here in Twin Falls, Shoshone Falls, looking at the effects of the Bonneville flood, and then another field trip uh, just to the west of us, about 30 miles near Hagerman, looking at some of the cool geologic features there, the role of lava and water, there's the Bliss Landslide, and a couple other cool places. So I finally got dates for these. I uh, hope you can join me. Let me take you now to the website. <clears throat> so my website, willseegeology.com, is where you want to go if you want to find out some more information and or sign up for these field trips. You can go to this top link here under field trips. Um, and the field trips are all laid out one by one. So here's the three trips in um, Salt Lake City area, Northern Utah at the end of September. So you can click on each one. Like for example, if you're interested in Little Cottonwood Canyon, uh, you can go here. There's some more information about the event, including um, some of the little short walks or hikes we do. Some uh, have very little um, you know, exertion required. Others might have a mile or so walk. So just consider your um, your ability level as you look at those. This one's a little bit more because uh, it includes a tram ride at Snowbird Resort up to the top of Hidden Peak. So there's the little Cottonwood one and again Antelope Island State Park, <clears throat> the Ogden to Echo one, Craters the Moon, City of Rocks, the diverse volcanoes of the Snake River Plains, Snake River Canyon and Lava and Water near Hagerman. So those are all laid out for you. There's a suggested donation amount, but if you click on that, that's where you can uh, sign up and register and be set to go. So I'm hoping there's some folks that are interested in going on some of these with me. If you have any questions, you can contact me through the website uh, down here at the bottom. And these run through Amanda Joe, who helps me out with much of this. And so she can answer your question or she can send it on to me if it's beyond her ability. The other thing you might do is go to this field trips facts page um, and listed here are just some general questions like where am I meeting? Uh, what should I bring with me? Generally the way these works is we all just show up at a specific meeting place at a certain time. You bring your own lunch generally. Uh, we, we, I do a quick orientation. Maybe there's some stuff to point out geologically at that location. And then we try to carpool as a group to our sites for the day. Uh, and then the field trip's over. Usually these ones will run about 9 to 5, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. given this time of year. Other ones closer to summertime might go a little earlier and end a little earlier just with uh, warmer weather. So you can get a lot of your questions answered here, but if not, you can uh, contact me and I can hopefully answer those for you. And hopefully I can see many of you on these field trips. And uh, with that, I'll just sign off. Thanks again for joining me. Thanks for building this great community of geo learners. And hopefully I'll see some of you out there. Take care.